Any drawing view of an assembly can be displayed in an exploded state, as long as the assembly already has an exploded view defined. If you want to add an isometric exploded view, notice it's available right here in the view palette. If you can't see it, either the assembly doesn't have an exploded configuration, or you might have to press the refresh button to refresh the views. You can just drag and drop the exploded view onto your drawing sheet, like you would any other view. As I mentioned a moment ago, any view can be shown in an exploded state. All you have to do is right-click the view and select Show an Exploded State. To bring it back, I can just right-click it again and select Show in an Unexploded State. Pretty easy, right? There's one more way to show a view in an exploded state that gives you a couple more options. If I right-click on a view and select Properties, and right here you see the option to show an exploded state, as soon as I click OK, you see the view update. Another option you have with an assembly view is to hide components. All I have to do is right-click and select Properties again. And here you see the Hide Show Components tab. Any components listed in this window will be hidden. To add components to the list, you just click on them in the Graphics window. And when you click OK, the component is hidden. To show the component again, repeat the process and take the component off the list by selecting its name and pressing delete on the keyboard.